Hello guys, today we're coming to you with the Reebok 9K chest protector review. So in this review I'm just going to do a little resume of this chest protector just to show you what you're getting when you buy this chest protector. So I'm going to start off with the shoulder flo floaters. Of course you guys know Reebok has very big shoulder floaters and I really like that because it gives you extra protection in the shoulders and sides down here but also keeps it high enough so that over the pucks can't go over your shoulders easy, right? So that's good. And the protection for your shoulders is basically the shoulder floater, the cup, and then this protection back here, as you can see, which is really nice that you won't be seeing those stingers that you usually get in the shoulders, which I used to get from my old iTech 4.8. So coming from an iTech 4.8, this is much bulkier as you can see of course so it takes a few skates to get used to the bulkier size but um, other than that they're pretty they're pretty much I mean chest protector is a chest protector also not seeing this in the eye tech was this nice plate right in the front here which is just hard plastic it um, it helps a lot like I've taken a few shots here and it does help quite a bit um, this neckline sits quite low on me, but I got a large, so, and I'm 5'10", I'm 130, so, I got a large just so I could grow into it, but that sits quite low, like, on me, but that's okay, because I'll grow into it. Um, the arms are, they protect, you don't know how much more than the old eye tech, like, you've got, if you can see over here, that there's just so much more protection in the arms. Like, they're just way nicer than, like, the other ones. Like, you can see in the back here and everything, there's that cup for your sh elbow, and it sits nice in there. I really think I like that cup for your elbow because my elbow sits perfectly in it, so it's quite comfortable. Um, like, the arms are just, they're nice. And the one thing about this, though, is that it takes a while to break the arms in because they're quite stiff when you first get it. Um, coming down here, you can see that there's these straps hanging down. Um, these are to actually attach your pants to. If you have Reebok pants, I mean, you could uh, rig something up with your other pants, but it's just meant to clip on, so I don't know if you guys like that kind of thing, but you could if you want to. So now I'm just going to turn turn the uh, chest protector around so you guys can see what the back looks like on this thing. So the back is quite nice. It's got this big back plate on it, um, which keeps it nice and snug to your chest so it's not flopping around as much. There's straps everywhere on this thing where you need it. The back of the arms, the shoulder floater straps, there's these straps here that you clip on to hold the chest protector on. Um, as you can see here too, it's a nice wraparound design. Like, Unlike my uh, iTech, it just sat flat. There was no side padding for your ribs and stuff. So I found that really nice feature about this one. If you ever take some off the side, it, you protect it there at least. Um, like I was saying, the shoulder cups, they're just made out of... Or, sorry, shoulder. The elbow cups are just made out of plastic, hard plastic. So your elbow sits nice in those. So if you ever fall, you don't feel it. Like I said, the arm protection in this thing is just great on the back. Like, there you, you've got all this protection here, so you don't have to worry about getting hurt on your arms anymore. Like I said, the arms are quite stiff. It takes about four to five skates to get used to the, the bigger, like, the bulkiness of this unit. And also about five skates, a good five skates, to break in the arms, because they're quite stiff when you first get it. But that's okay, because once you get it broken in, then your protection level is just great, like much better than my iTech, big time. Um, like I was saying, the wraparound design, I'll flip it down for you guys here. So, as you can see on the inside of it, it's nice. This back plate here keeps it nice and snug to your body, nice and it's just good, very good unit. So, uh, that's about it for the review. There's not much more to say about this thing. It's uh, it's a good deal if you want something with good protection. It, well, I paid $250 for that with tax. So, I mean, if you guys are looking into Reebok and you want something with a good level of protection 
and not so expensive, then I would go with the Reebok 9K chest protector. Thank you very much, guys. Have a good day. Post any comments if you have a question, and I'll answer them uh, as soon as I can. Thanks.